In June 2018, Michigan made changes to its lead and copper rule. Revisions to the rule established new water sampling requirements to test for lead and copper. It also requires Michigan water suppliers to replace all lead service lines on both public and private property over the next 20 years. This video shows you how to determine what type of service line you have in your home. Once you've identified the type of service line in your home, we recommend that you contact your local water supplier for more information on how to obtain the proper testing kit for your home. For information on how to test your home's drinking water for lead and copper, visit Great Lakes Water Authority's YouTube channel. Before you can test the drinking water in your home for lead and copper, you will need to know the type of material your service line is made of. A service line can be made of galvanized steel, lead, copper, or plastic. You will need a flathead screwdriver and a magnet to determine the type of material your service line is made of. If you have a metal pipe below the first shutoff valve, use the flat edge of the screwdriver to carefully scratch through any corrosion that may have built up on the outside of the pipe. Put the magnet on the scratched area. If it sticks to the pipe, it is galvanized steel. If the magnet does not stick and the scraped area is a shiny silver color that looks like a nickel, the pipe is made of lead. If the magnet does not stick, and the scraped area is copper in color, and it looks like a penny, the pipe is made of copper. If the pipe feels like plastic, is white or gray in color, and joined with a clamp, glued, or screwed together, it is plastic, and no further testing is required. Note, the piping above the shutoff valve is known as the water line to house plumbing. It should not be tested, as it is likely made of a different material than the service line. If you find that you have a lead service line in your home, you should follow the recommendations for reducing your exposure to lead in your drinking water. It is important to understand that if your service line is made of a different material, you could still have a lead pipe underground that is not visible, especially if you live in an older home. We recommend that you call your water supplier to find out if their records indicate the service line material for your home. If you are still unsure about the type of service line that is connected to your home and cannot find the service line or cannot conduct the test yourself, please contact your local water supplier. You can find a complete and extensive explanation of the new lead and copper rules at michigan.gov forward slash LCR. Thank you.